Hello everyone. Uh, in my last video, I have shown you how to design a sidebar header with Elementor Pro. Uh, in this video, let me show you how to design the same thing with Elementor Free. Yeah, for that, we have to, to use third-party add-on header footer and blocks by Benstorm Pros. Yeah. Uh, we can, there are also other header footer builder add-on for Elementor. You can use that, but for today, let's use the, use this plugin first uh, yeah like the um, like we did in elementor pro we have to design uh, the template first sidebar header template This is just a custom block and yeah, Elementor Canvas is fine, you can publish it. It did with Elementor. Now, here. Full white, no gap, like this, a little background color, and some paddings, about 20 pixel at the top, 50 at the right, 100 at the bottom, 50 at the left, like this, and a height, fit to screen, column position top like this. Now let's start adding, say logo. Source. Navigation menu. layout vertical like this okay you can change the color and all like this okay and yeah, you can add social icons you get the point okay update this now let's go back to the dashboard once again oh, sorry here shortcut you can copy this and add new now it, this is time is sidebar header not a template and uh, sidebar header okay now choose option header add display rule hey, sorry here entire website user rows all okay and Publish Edit with Elementor Full White No Gap and you can insert a short code. Yes. Short code like this, and in the positioning, fix custom white about 300 like this. Update it 
Now let's check it on the front end. Yeah, here, here it is our sidebar header. Yeah, it's quite the same with the Elementor Pro. The, with the uh, header that we designed with Elementor Pro, there's not much difference. The difference is here, this widget's logo widget, search widget, and navigation menu widget. These are all uh, part of this header footer um, and blocks by Benstone Pro. This third-party add-on for Elementor, so we cannot uh, use the Elementor Pro widgets. Those widgets are not available in the free Elementor. So, yeah, since these are only this, uh, we do not. Uh, yeah, oh. <laughs> this is not complicated. <laughs> We just only change uh, the widgets and the area area where we design the header here. In the Elementor Pro, we use the design you here in these Elementor templates. But for this plugin here, we go to the appearance and header footer. That's the only thing the is difference. Others are the same, same process for us design the template and insert the short code inside the header. So yeah, it's the same. If you have not watched my previous video about designing the same sidebar header with Elementor Pro, then yeah, check it out. You can uh, put this sidebar on the right side too. So it's the same process here, uh, like this, horizontal orientation on the sidebar, update it, refresh this space, like this, yeah. So it's quite easy. It is fixed here, so you can put many things here, like email, phone number, social icons, say it or many things like uh, promotional promotional notifications notice like anything you can put here so it's quite convenient way of designing header uh, with elementor base builder website builder this is the unconventional header most headers are available on the 12 but cyber headers some sort of unconventional method of designing header uh, yeah, sometimes depends on the project. General websites does not need sidebar headers, but sometimes you may need sidebar headers. Uh, and also, it depends on the request of your client. If your customer, your client requests you know, one that uh, wants their website, wants their website having yeah sidebar headers, then yeah, you have to design sidebar header. So yeah. It's just a window paper. It's quite easy once you know the trick. Yeah. And I hope this video is helpful to you. If you like this video, find it helpful, please click the thumbs up button. If you have not subscribed to YouTube channel, please subscribe now.